Well, as most of you know, and all of you will now, I shoot all these car videos I make by myself, bootleg style, survivor man style, whatever you want to call them. I've used some of those shots in my outtakes. So I thought I'd take a second to show you the tools of the trade. You can see now that you have the camera pointed at me on my suction cup mount on the hood of my own car, and then I'm using my iPhone to shoot that shot as well. So let me walk you through this suction cup mount because this is something I kind of designed based on some internet stuff and my own ideas, and I thought I'd show it to you real quick. This is a shot I commonly use in my videos, the in-car driving shot. You've seen it on Motor Trend, you've seen it pretty much on every YouTube channel. Now those guys have extremely high priced rigs where you can essentially suction cup bars to any place you want in the car and you can place the camera anywhere you want on those bars. I don't have the budget those guys have, so I had to come up with my own solution and that's what I wanna show you guys now. Okay, so here we are in my workshop. You're gonna have to excuse the mess. I got a ton of uh, projects going on, but I'll quick show you. So this is the ubiquitous Harbor Freight Tools dual suction cup mount, glass holder, or whatever, $5.99. Thing's awesome. Holds 200 pounds. I mean, when these are on there secure, it, it'll it pull the, the, the sheet metal, the bodywork of the car out. You know what I mean? It'll just, it's so strong. Uh, this I got from Amazon. It is called the Heavy Duty Ball Head, I believe. I'll put some links to that. And then this is a bracket from uh, Home Depot, which you'll find like near the deck section. I believe this is for railings. The two by four goes in here as it mounts to the side of a deck, okay? All I did was attach the bracket to the Harbor Freight Tools suction cup mount, and then I mounted this tripod head. This thing is heavy duty and it's like 20 bucks. I love it, it's awesome. It makes me feel very secure about having my, car, my uh, camera on there, expensive camera. But so all said and done, I think $5.99 plus 20 plus like $2.99 and some bolts under 30 bucks for really what is a heavy duty, almost in many ways pro grade uh, suction cup mount for the video camera. So a couple key ideas. First of all, I used a quarter 20 thread uh, quarter inch bolt to go through the handle. I got it as close to the suction cup mount as possible so as to maintain kind of that structural rigidity of this plastic. This is just molded plastic, okay? Also on the inside of those, I put um, bolts on the ins both sides of the handle so that um, basically you're just pinching the, uh, you're pinching the plastic between the two bolts instead of crushing that plastic and basically having to do that on you. Okay. So it, it pinch bolts basically. So there's actually one, one, two, three bolts on there, not including the, uh, the head on this end. Okay. Now, because this is so heavy duty, this actually uses a three eighth inch bolt, but same concept. I used, uh, bolts on both sides to pinch the sheet metal. So again, it's not being squeezed and it gives you more strength and it allows you to get it much tighter. So it allows you to run it whatever way you want, straight up and down side to side. And it allows me to be the, um, you know, the indie DIY survivor man style camera work, uh, car reviewer. I am. Thanks for watching. Let me know if you have any questions.